Welcome to the Rustic Garden. Today is Sunday, July 10th, and I'm going to show you how I feed my squash, cucumber, zucchini, sort of mid-season, give them an extra boost. And what I'd like to do is take a gallon of water, one tablespoon of Epsom salt, one tablespoon of calcium nitrate that provides a water-soluble form of calcium, which is really important for blossom end rot, especially for tomatoes, peppers, and even your squash and zucchini. And I'm using an all-purpose fertilizer, Job's Organic. That's a great um, organic fertilizer with a low NPK that'll give your plants what they need. So I mix them all into a container together. I'm going to show you how I pour it on because so, some people ask me, well, how much you know, do you put on per plant? I just soak the leaves, soak some of the soil, and then water it in. But here we have one of my squash plants and it's producing nicely. You can see a scalloped squash in there. Cucumbers are producing. This is a lemon cucumber that is just starting to get the female flowers. Down in here is a yellow squash. You can see some of them starting to form in there. And they're all at kind of different growth heights, which is good, but you can see some yelling. Oh, there's a cucumber down there. I missed that one. They're starting to yellow a little bit. They've been growing heavily. They've been growing steadily. So I'm giving them a boost. Let me mix this up and then I'll just show you how I pour scallop it. squash and it's doing pretty well. You can just see how green it is. And come mid-July, a little bit later July, a lot of the squashes and cucumbers start to yellow. And sometimes that's really just because they're sucking the nutrients out of the soil. And you can see cucumber variety in there. They're starting to lighten up a little bit. So that's when I like to give them a feeding. Let me also show you some of the cucumbers that are growing over here. These are going to get the same thing. These are bush cucumbers, market more cucumbers, nice and green, doing well, growing. You don't need to wait till the plant starts showing distress. There's some great looking cucumbers in there. I'm going to pick all the fruit before I give them a feeding. But some point after they've been growing, they're producing, you can see another cucumber in there, give them a good feeding. I like to use the Epsom salt, calcium nitrate, and Job's Organic. You don't need to use calcium nitrate. It's just something that I do. You can put it in, you can leave it out, it's up to you. But it does give that uh, feeding a form of calcium that's quickly absorbed by the plant when it's needed. And you also should only use Epsom salt, maybe planting, you know, once a month at the most, but I like to do it at mid-season. You don't need to use Epsom salt every week, that's too much. Here's the harvest from all the plants that I'm gonna feed today with the Epsom salt, calcium nitrate, and uh, Job's Organic. This is one of my uh, pickle bush cucumbers. Again, it's in a container, the bottom's cut out. But it's really just putting in about a quarter gallon right in there. And then I just soak the top down, nothing fancy. Maybe a half a gallon altogether. Same thing with this one. And that's all I put in there. And I would do the same thing for the cucumbers, for the squash, for the zucchini over there, and for the larger cucumber plants. About a half a gallon, soak the leaves, soak the soil, and you want to do this in the morning or later evening, don't do it in full sun. And again, the most important thing really is to give them an NPK feeding. If you want to add in the Epsom salt, you can go ahead and do that. If you want to add in some calcium nitrate, you can go and do that. But it's really important that you don't think you have to put in thousands of different things. Use what you like, test things out, read, figure out, you know, what routine works best for you, and give your cucumber, zucchini, and squash a really good mid-season feeding to, you know, get them back on track. Hope you enjoyed the video. Please check out my blog at www.therestofgarden.blogspot.com, and also check out my YouTube videos. Thanks.